So here I have a 50-50 mix of modelling paste and fondant that I roll out to about 3cm thick. Then using a pre-made template I cut out the shape for my character. Then add some corn flour to the mat just to help it stop sticking. Now I'm just placing some um, edible cocoa butter into some ramekins. I heat that just for a few seconds in the microwave till it's melted. I'm then going to add some black petal dust, just a little, because I want it nice and light, because I'm going to sketch the outline of my picture. So as you can see, I go in nice and lightly at first, so this is just to help. If you do make a mistake, it's easier to try and correct it, because it's not too dark. If at any point the cocoa butter becomes less pliable, just pop it back in the microwave for a couple of seconds. So I mixed together some red and white petal dust with some cocoa butter to get this lovely pink colour. I'm just going back in with that black now, I've made it darker just to make it pop. Just going in now using a finer brush just to get that finer detail. So now I'm just making up a cake for him to go on. Just a nice easy buttercreamed cake. So throwing on lots of buttercream. And then to get a nice thick layer of that buttercream on there, I'm using the Wilton 2B nozzle just to pipe that on. And then going in there with a cake smoother, try and get that all nice and smooth. Once it's been in the fridge for about 20 minutes, I then use a warm palette knife just to get that really smooth. So now I'm just putting on some light grey buttercream and just smoothing that out to get this kind of really nice watercoloured effect on the cake. And then lastly, I'm just going to go in with that grey icing and just pipe some little ice gems on top. 